I've got sissy is so good with red horse beer. What is that? Masala. Masala. So you're not picking that up with your hands, you burn your fingers. <laughs> yeah. Guys, Hi guys. Welcome, welcome back, back to uh, Jay's channel, British Filipino couple. Obviously we're not a couple. <laughs> his wife yeah. is not here at the minute. <laughs> yeah. So guys, uh, me and Alex decide to uh, make a vlog once a week. And our content is mainly eating Filipino food because Alex love Filipino food basically. Absolutely love it. So and uh, last time if you watch our le uh, previous videos yeah you eat Filipino food and you like it. This yeah. time guys <clears throat> we have uh, sisig which is mainly pork that and smells good. intestine and liver my mouth's water and <laughs> pork uh, skin yeah with egg inside uh, with, with the egg as well so that's it. Uh, we have also tinulang manok, which is chicken soup. Yeah. So hopefully you like it. And we have also red horse. Oh, smells there. amazing. Filipino red horse there. Yeah, this looks good. All right. We get a. Uh, let's go. That's it. Alex. Dip it in. Yeah. Put it in first. Sure. We're gonna use our hands, guys. And. Yeah. Oh, this looks Try absolutely the lovely. Authentic Filipino. Sisi, it's the best. It looks it's like a real best. good meal for like after work mm. as well. Wow. It's really good. It's melting in my mouth, Alex. Mm. Oh my god. Mm. Seasoned nice as well. Yeah. Plus with the soup, like that. Mm. Mm. Wow. So. You're a very one, good cook. We call it sisi. Mm -hmm. in the Philippines and it's really traditional so would you have this like day to day or would you have this for like a birthday party or Christmas or a actually, special occasion actually it's like this one it's like when we're drinking red horse beer mm -hmm. this is our side dish like oh, is it? in Britain you know like you, you like crisp <clears throat> like drunk snacks yeah yeah like this one is like oh we call it polotan okay we, we drink beer we, yep. we eat this one. So you drink and then you eat. It's like Sounds good. you drink and then you eat crisp. But yeah, in, in, yeah, yeah. in the Philippines, we drink, we, we eat this one with rice. I haven't and, tried the, the soup mm. yet. Oh yeah, that's nice. Yeah. That's really good. Wow. It's like really fresh as well. Yeah. Like really like, it tastes like really, really healthy. Yeah, with mix, mixed vegetables on it. Mm. And the chicken's chili. really soft as well. Mm. The best. I was starving as well. We have one big rice cooker, guys. Shout out to Koya Nistor. We got this one from. Uh, oh, is that in Yeah, yeah. In yeah, that's a really, really, really yeah. good, good um, shop. Mm -hmm. Like delivers, doesn't he? Yeah. Yeah. Alex, dip it in. Yeah, I want nice. you to eat more. But that's one Filipino tradition I like. Yeah. You always get me to eat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but hope you you like our video, guys, because uh, from this time, me and Alex will be making videos once a week together. <clears throat> well, the girls are going out for a drive. Yeah, <laughs> because as you know, Emma don't really like making video in front of the camera, like eating. Mm -hmm. She don't mind going for trouble, mm -hmm. but eating in camera, she don't really like it. She's shy. The thing is with me is like, everyone eats, everyone drinks. Mm. 
natural thing to do. So if you do it on camera, do it off camera. It doesn't matter to me. Yeah. And you get to you get to try some good food as well. Yeah. This is really good. You can literally all the flavors in this are like. Yeah, with the egg. All it. coming through as well. Yeah, with the eggs. Yeah. Absolutely lovely. This is really like very famous in the Philippines, Alex. Mm. If you go in the Philippines and you not try this one, you haven't been. You haven't <laughs> been in the Philippines. And in our street foods, it's really, really good. Mm. It's the best. Obviously, we have English as well. We usually eat, obviously, with knife and fork. But mm. I actually quite prefer eating with my hands because it feels like you can taste everything better. Yeah. Like, I said, I can't describe it. It's literally like just eating off your hands. Like, there's no like metal, there's no nothing. Yeah. It's literally just like, it's just so easy. But people don't like it. Like, Some people are. I wouldn't go to like an English restaurant, thank you very much, and like eat with my hands just because people won't accept it. Yeah. Like, here, but, well, they would, like, you can do what you want, but. Cheers, man. It's good. Thank you very much. Cheers, guys. Cheers. <laughs> Filipino Red Horse beer. Mm. Oh, man, that's good. You like it last time? That's really it? good. That is really, really good. Oh, my goodness. Strong as well. Mm. So that's 7%. That's yeah. like, that's a strong beer for here as well. It's the best. It's perfect in, in the Philippines. Like, people are gathering around, buy beer, cook food with this. Sisig, we call it sisig. Yeah. And sit down in, in, in the side road. Like, oh, is it? Chair, yeah, outside like, and all like, that. Yeah, outside. That's well cool. I love sit that. Sit down. Have a beer with the Pulutan. We call it Pulutan. That's amazing. It's really good. Amazing. Yeah, I miss that life in the Philippines, really. That sounds absolutely mm. brilliant. Here yeah. it's always like cold or raining or... Yeah. In the summer, it's quite nice. Like on your roof, on your rooftop. Yeah, we can do it. That one again. That's, that's, uh, that's in, really, in really summer, good. Yeah. <clears throat> on, yeah, your rooftop's mm. lovely as well. Like, especially in the summer, absolutely boiling. There, yeah. But, Obviously nothing on the Philippines heat, but... We still have loads, guys, look. Oh, yeah. So many, Alex. So many. Right, so you said, we got to try this and the beer, yeah? Yeah. Hopefully next week, guys, Alex have time to make another video again. Just leave a comment. Just leave a comment, oh which God. really good, isn't it? That is really good. Two it's, flavors together is brilliant. Yeah. Have you tried? We've done lechon already, the big pork. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, that was so cool. So I literally never, ever had anything like that in my life. Yeah. Maybe we try. Nothing. Just leave a comment, guys. Maybe we will try uh, ultimate Filipino breakfast. Maybe we'll that try sounds that. good. Yeah, I'll, I'll eat anything. Cheers, we man. will we will try ultimate uh, Filipino breakfast, guys. It's gonna be fun, or maybe oh, soup's lovely. I taste yeah. of ginger in it as well. Yeah. Or maybe we we will do a travel vlog as well next time. <coughs> you can take me to the Philippines. <laughs> yeah. By the way, guys, when we're going to the Philippines, Alex and Hannah will come with us. So probably. Definitely. I've always wanted to go. You will see them in personal in the Philippines. Yeah, always wanted to go. It looks like a lovely place. Mm. Wow. I have the chicken as well. It's really mm. thin there. Mm. Really, really good. The best, Alex. I think this is my favourite thing about Filipino culture is literally just like food and drinks <laughs> <laughs> and the socialising and stuff. Yeah. Like... Alex. I think he's the only British I know in the UK that loves Filipino food. Like, I think a lot of other like British like, people as well would like it, but I don't think they get the opportunity to try it because I don't think, like, off the top of my head, I don't think there's any like Filipino restaurants or no, anything not, like yeah. not around here anyway. No. They may be in like London, but in London, you have. We, we have. might. We might. We go. Maybe. In the future, like guys, we go to London or we're gonna go to the Filipino restaurant. I'll be well up for that. Yeah. That'd be good. That'd be really, really good. Maybe we can try their 
authentic Filipino delicacies there. I was listening, mm. but what's in here again? It's like pork belly. Pork belly, pork intestine, pork liver, and the face of the, the pork. Oh, cheeks. You know, like, yeah. No, like, cheeks. You know, like uh, skin and fats. Mm. And that's why, that's why you got this, the, the crunchiness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, because that's the cheek. It's the best. Yeah, that's well good. Mm. That's really, really good. So is this like, if you're out on a par at like party night, would you have this like all the time? Or is this like your go-to you... beer? Hmm? Or is this like your, like, like your beer that you'd have like this is our, on a party? This is our like traditional, but there is another one that is more traditional than this. Yeah. But this is more, the, the reason why people love this one, because it's more strong mm. and can make you drunk easily mm -hmm. rather than our traditional beer we have traditional beer like san miguel beer yeah i know san miguel yeah oh, san miguel, filipino? yeah it's filipino but it's uh, actually it's a trademark of spain mm. it's from spain but in the philippines we back like 100 years ago we are colonized by spain mm. so all the all their food drinks and that's why we get used to drink with the san miguel and this one is also no not san miguel but this is this is one of the the second best beer in the Philippines. Very it's well really known. good. Very it's well known. really really nice. If you are if you ask all Filipino, they will know this beer, Red Horse. It's nice as well because it's like mm. like a lager, like it's fizzy, yeah, fizzy and cold. Mm. Like you go to a pub sometimes, like in England, and it's like you get like ale, yeah, which is like mm. flat beer, so mm. it's like not fizzy and stuff. And it's sometimes it's a little bit. You can have like one pint, and that's it. It's like a yeah. roast dinner and a pine <laughs> and i bought this one on uh from my friend as well that i bought the the seasoning oh yeah the ingredients it's also like traditional when you go to the restaurant you will get exactly the same size as this oh really and like sizzling and then really hot put That's the egg in the really middle. yeah because that tray yeah, that yeah. sizzling when it came yeah. out wasn't it <laughs> it's really good glad you like it man mm -hmm. because yeah yeah, you're cooking. I know right? you like Filipino food, but this is one of the best authentic food in the Philippines. It's this literally one. look just falling off. It's lovely. Yeah. This guys is tinulang manok, which is I put like so many vegetables on it: carrots, broccoli, and sweet corn on it. It's like it's nice actually. Mm. It's like a really nice flavor, like mm. a really nice stock. Mm. It's also really nice that because I finished work, yeah. Jay's cooked me dinner, <laughs> so I don't have to cook tonight. <laughs> yeah, come on, more, 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 and then we're gonna drink beer, we're gonna be drunk, just like your birthday. Yeah, <laughs> Alex is uh, he's not really my friend, he's my family, he's, oh, my, he's my brother, you know. Yeah, Cheers. we go in, we go holiday together, and we spend that last holiday. Together. Was yeah, good. Is the best. that was really really good. You have to mm. show everyone in like yeah. a video of the holiday. Next time, guys, when we do holiday, we'll make a vlog. But it'd be in the Philippines, so everyone can be in it. Yeah, <laughs> mm. we have to do a meet up. Wow. All the flavors in this are so nice. Mm. Like. Everything together is really, really good. But like you can taste like each individual part at the same time, like it's absolutely lush. Wow. If we go to the Philippines, I want you to go in El, El Nido. It's the best in the world. Is that the a place? Best, yeah, one of the best place and island. It's a small island, but it's you can do highland hopping, you go to the oh, one cool. island, good second island, third island, it's the best. Mm. <clears throat> that does sound really, really good. Mm. I, like, I just want to see like the mm. blue water. Yeah. Like really blue sea or some or mm. blue lakes or whatever. As you see loads of videos of them, yeah. you really want to go there. Um, guys, leave a comment below. 
uh, suggestions what delicacies of Filipino that you want us to eat with Alex <clears throat> and then maybe I will cook or maybe I will order from my friend uh, Ismail or Kuenisto or Kuya John <clears throat> and then we'll do mukbang <clears throat> do you know what right do you know what's really funny when you say mukbang yeah I used to think that was Filipino for food yeah <laughs> like but way. it's like it's like a YouTube eating thing isn't it like it started in Korea oh did it yeah like I literally just like mukbang I thought that was mm. literally like Filipino for food because I hear it like quite a lot mukbang mukbang yeah yeah wow and when I looked up the meaning and stuff I was like ah oh, right okay I'm an idiot yeah it's uh, <laughs> originally uh, from Korea and then we we copy from Korea like, and then around the world people eating doing content eating food and yeah. then it's boom and then people copied it which is that's what we're doing right now which is good we introduced to to my british friend and my brother here and he likes he loves our food he loves our filipino food and i love fish mm. fish as well oh um i just want to say shout out to my uh old friend in southampton Brian Akain, Francis Willaber, uh, Goya Ismael, Koya Nistor, Goya John, and sa lahat ng mga, to all my family in Leyte, say hi to them, call my family in Philippines. Hello Filipino family. We Cheers. love you and we miss you. <laughs> Hopefully get to see you one day. Yeah, we will, maybe next year or hopefully next year, if not, then maybe next it's year. It's quite, um... It's quite expensive, isn't it, to go um, from England to the Philippines yeah, it's on like flights? Nine hundred pounds. Yeah, but you know, it doesn't. It doesn't really matter. Like you just yeah. save up and have like the best holiday ever. Yeah. It's good rice as well. Yeah, that's uh, jasmine rice. It's really good. Oh. I think jasmine wow. rice as well is really, really good for uh, like a sticky rice. Yeah. I'm getting full now. Right, guys. Uh, me and Alex is full already. Um, just leave a comment again Very down good. below which food, what food you want us to eat again next time, maybe next week. If Alex have uh, time to make a video, because he's busy, I'm busy as well. And... We will see you again. Uh, leave a comment, guys, who wants a shout out, and we will do a shout out next time. Definitely. Love you guys. Bye. See you later, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you. <laughs>